YouTube, what up, man? Having Bulls Gap, Tennessee. Gonna get loaded up with some lumber, man. Tell y'all something real quick. I'm only tarping this load because they got a tarp station for me to tarp it, but I'm about to stop tarping these loads because whenever you pick up, stuff is sitting outside, man. It don't make no sense. Then when you drop off, they pick it up and drop it off outside. You know? That's why I say I'm about to stop tarping this stuff. I'm going to show y'all what it looked like once I stop following this four-wheel driver right now. But I just dropped off my gray bar load that I had. Steam man, there's a guy changing out the uh, porta potty thing. Show y'all what this stuff look like, man. Outside getting rained on. I'm gonna do it this time, man. I was just telling a few guys in Maverick that I work with and talk to on a daily basis that um, I don't wanna go and tarp this load. But since they got a tarp station, I'm gonna go out here tarp it. I am about to change pants and put on some pants and my steel toe shoes. Dude gotta throw straps. Go ahead with my shorts, man. My favorite short jumping off the trailer. I had uh shorts got hooked to a bungee. They had tour. Yeah, man. I ain't even brush my teeth or wash my face this morning because when I got up I untarped. Then it started raining. Yeah, so when I got up, I on tarp this morning. I did my pre-trip and all that. So I was waiting to the place to waiting for the place to open up. Then it started sprinkling, so I said, let me go and throw this steel tarp back on. It didn't take that long for me to untarp and tarp it back. It's all good. It's a little right here. I'm going to um Chicago Heights, Illinois. Say eight. Let me see. Load it. Make you put this on your windshield whenever y'all come here. Bulls Gap, Tennessee. The place is called um, Barry Outdoor Living. On the Chicago Heights, that's a let me see. Let me try to get to Illinois today. Um, Cottage Four hundred thirty-seven miles loaded. Let me see how far it is. Nine hours, man. Nine hours. Let me 
see if it's a quicker route. I gotta go through. Louisville, Indianapolis, all the way up by Gary, Indiana. Or I got a choice to go through Columbus, Cincinnati, through Indianapolis. But those take longer. No toll routes are through Cincinnati and Columbus. I may take the toll routes in 10 minutes shorter. through Louisville around Louisville uh, through Indianapolis once I get to Indianapolis that's where the wrecks and stuff are at <sighs> that should be fine man um, yeah, I'm gonna take this route winding road ahead 1738 is when they say I should be there. Ask. Let's see. 1738. I don't know what time it is. Let's say 1500. It's 3. 16, 4. 538, it's safe. I still got a tarp and secure down. That should be here around like seven something. I may go to the Portage Terminal. Let me see how far that is. It's an hour outside of Chicago. Let me see. Portage, Indiana. Yeah, it's about the same. Yeah, it's right up there. I'm driving. Yeah, that's where I'm going to go. Portage Terminal. Yeah, I ain't want nothing, man. I just wanted to tell y'all. If y'all ever got a tarp below for the new people at Maverick, it says to tarp it and shit sitting outside, man. I wouldn't even do it, you know. It's up to y'all, man. I know drivers. I ain't going to, you know, put them out there like that. You know, whatever floats your boat, man. You know? So, yeah, I'm going to take a picture of this load. You know, take a picture of a tarp. Show y'all my last load. It's going to be my video. Next video coming out. Not the gray bar load, but the video before that, I think. Put some on my last lumber load. Should have dropped today. This should drop a day or two from now. And I'll... See y'all once I drop this load in Chicago tomorrow. I'm out, man. Says your name, Michael Jackson, right? Jackson. What about your son? What's his name? Alan Jackson. Alan Jackson. Yeah. I actually named him Alan Michael, so I can't even vote him. <laughs> okay. Well, nice running into you, man. Nice, nice to meet you, man. I appreciate your help. Yeah, hopefully. All right, man. Park for the night. Doing my pre-trip. I want to show y'all something, though, man. Uh, out here in Remington, Indiana Park. Check this out. The dude, Michael Jackson, from earlier. Showed me a better way to bungee, you know, lumber loads. Kind of just take the bungee, put the one up there. Go under the rubber rail, go back right there. This actually will not flap down the road. Now, it might balloon up, but you'll still be able to see what's behind you as long as, you know, tarp them, them flaps and, uh, you know, your edges back here. But as you can see, I did all the bungees like that. I actually like that way, it's not that hard. Yeah, if you bungee down the back like this, just take two or three and do like that. 
kind of won't balloon up. Um, you'll be able to see the traffic behind you, you know. Yeah, that's all I wanted to show y'all, man. Uh, drop this low in the morning, Chicago Heights. And then I'm a, um, then I'm going to, they already sent me a pre-plan for my home load. I won't be on to Saturday morning. And it delivers uh, Monday morning. Uh, so it's, uh, it's trailer parts from uh, Pierce 10, Indiana to Perigo, Arkansas, which is hour and a half, two hours away from me, I think. I think it's an hour and a half uh, from where I live at, so. Yeah, now I'll be back out on Monday. I uh, will see y'all once I pick up tomorrow, man. I'm out.